Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Okay, so for today's video, I went, like I told you in my previous video, if you have not watched that, you guys should totally go. I hauled Bath & Body Works products for the semi-annual sale. It is amazing, you should go check it out. Um, but to, for today's video, I went to Lush and then during the sale they had there, I decided to get a bunch of stuff from Lush. And there's a whole lot in here and I can't wait to show you guys what's inside this bag. Let's get this video started. So guys, I went to Lush the other day to go and check out the buy one get one sale because select products in the store were buy one get one free and that's always amazing when there's a sale at Lush because they never have sales. So I decided to go in and pick up a bunch of stuff so I want to show you right now what's in this amazing bag. So let's start off. Okay, so this, oh it's in a nice, alright, so it broke a little bit in the bag which I find sometimes happens but this is this is Naughty Elf, everyone. So as you can see, it's a bubble bar. And a bubble bar, basically, they say it can only be used twice. I think you can use it as many times as you want, as long as you break off a little bit of it and run it under the water. It's perfect, and it can be used so many times, unlike a, a bath bomb. So this is Naughty Elf, like I said. It smells very, very, like, I would almost describe it as kind of like a, like a fruity kind of scent. Almost a little bit of like musk, maybe. I really like the scent of this. Um, it's really good. I like the, like I said, it broke, but I really do like the uh, design. It looks really fun. You can see its nose and its beard. Very, very, um, very nice bath bomb. Very nice looking, but it broke a little bit. Okay, so that's the first thing. So the second thing I bought, this is Holy Night bath bomb. This is Holy Night bath bomb. Look away if you don't like looking at little holes, but uh, it's Holy Night bath bomb and it's a very nice smell. It smells a little lemony, very clean. They always smell very clean um, and it smells, yeah, it smells very lemony, very fresh. It smells very good. So there's a look at that. Very nice blue color as well. Um, I got this one for free, um, but usually this one's about $6.95, but Obviously, I don't think they're selling their Christmas stuff at this point when they're seeing the video, but if they bring any of the stuff back for next year, it's just a good way to know uh, what they had and if you see any of the stuff next year. So the next product I got, let's see. So this, oh, this is my favorite. This is one of my favorites from them. This is Lord of Misrule. It's a spicy, it's, it's almost a spicy scent. It's kind of sweet at the same time. Um, but it's really good. It has an amazing purple and greenish color when it diffuses. Uh, really amazing. I like it. Um, and I definitely like the green color. And it smells it smells a little bit spicy, but at the same time, I think it smells a little bit sweet too. I think it smells very, very nice. Again, I feel like all of them smell sweet, or at least some of them do. But this smells very nice. So there is Lord of Mistral. You can see it's a little crown on it. It is so amazing. You always have to be careful when you put these back in the bag that they don't spray. All right, so let's move on to the next one. So this one, so this one is one that they have year round. Um, I've never not seen it in the store. I think they keep this one there all the time. Uh, this is Karma Bubble Bar. Now this is one of my favorite bubble bars. It's $11.95. Oh, and if I didn't tell you guys, uh, Lord of Bistro is about $7.95, I believe. Um, but this is $11.95. A little expensive, but I think it is totally worth it because of the smell. Oh, it smells so good. It smells floral, it smells fresh, and it has a very nice um, floral smell, I would say. I'd say perfect for spring, too. Very nice and clean. It all in smell amazing. And uh, it has a great color in the back. I think it's a bit of a, a pink color. Okay, so moving on. Uh, this one I got. This is now, this is like a favorite at Lush. If you've ever, if you've sticked with the company, you know that this is one they always have, and this is one that everybody's trying to always get, I feel like. And I managed to get one, because usually I go into the store and they never have it there, but this time they have the Rose Jam Bubble Room. Now, a bubble room is basically the same as a bubble bar. It can be used um, just to make bubbles, and again, it can be cut. And that is the great thing with these, is unlike the bath bombs, those are really hard to cut. But these, you can cut it easily and use a little bit, so you can use this as many times as you would like. Or you can use the whole thing in one um, amazing bath, but that's going to create a mountain of bubbles. But this has a very nice 
floral scent. This one definitely is flowery and spring, and it definitely smells like roses, like they say. That's a very, very nice scent. So if you're into um, sort of that um, flowers and kind of spring scent, this is a perfect one. So I picked it up because I really wanted to try it to see if I like it when spring comes along. Oh, it smells so good. And it definitely, that's the best way I can describe it. It's very flowery. It's very, if that's a, I think that's a word, but it's very flowery. It's very nice. So these next two things don't come in a bag because I picked them up earlier, but I shouldn't have. I should have waited for the sale. Uh, this is the Candy Cane um, Bubble Bar. This is another bubble bar. I have so many. It smells very, um, it, smells, it smells okay. It's not my favorite. One of the things that really disappointed me about this, you guys, and oh, let me just show you really quickly. I I'm, I'm probably already showed you, but I'm gonna just put up to the camera again. Very, you see, it looks like almost like a macaron. See how it looks like that? So, and if I didn't say, that one goes for $8.95, the Rose Gamble Room. So this is a candy cane bubble bar. Uh, this one is, again, I like it. Like, I like the look of it. It looks very fun, festive. I would think of this as a total Christmas set. Now, looking at this, you would think, oh, this smells like peppermint, but it doesn't. It has a bit of a lemon smell, and that kind of, kind of, that wasn't my favorite. I really wish they had made a peppermint smell. I'm sure they could have, but yeah, I, it's not my personal favorite. Uh, it definitely has a little bit of a lemon smell. It ha mine smells a little bit musty, which is odd. Um, it came in a box, so I don't know if it's just that. But I mean, it's not my favorite, you guys. I wouldn't personally get it again, but that is the um, candy can. I don't know the price, but I assume it's somewhere in the $6 to $9 range. There you go. But not my favorite. Um, all the other ones I really like, but that one was definitely not my favorite. Now this one is my favorite probably for Christmas. It is amazing. You can see this is the um, Putty Holly, or this is, or no, I'm sorry, excuse me. This is Luxury Lush Pudding. I'm getting the name wrong, this is my favorite one. Uh, this is Luxury Lush Pudding. It looks, it has really beautiful colors. And it, I, the best way I can describe this is it literally smells like candy. It's, they actually have a gift box, or they did, where it was in it, it was called the Candy Gift Box, because this smells like candy, you guys. I've already used three of these this, this season because it's literally my favorite. I kept going in there and I kept buying it because it literally, I just love it so, so much. You guys don't understand. Oh, it smells so good. But the best way I can describe it again is it smells like candy. This goes, again, around $7 to that $8 range. So again, uh, a little bit expensive, but I totally think it is worth it for the holiday season. And um, I'm gonna pull this out. And so this is a gift box I got. Now this isn't a Christmas gift box. This is Happy Bath Day. So I think they're trying for this to be a birthday gift, but somebody gave it to me uh, at Christmas, and I, you know what? If you give me Lush at Christmas, it's the most amazing gift, in my opinion. I love how, by the way, you guys, that they show who packaged it. They show the person on here, and it actually says, like, who packaged it, and that, I think, is so cool. But anyway, this has four things in it, you guys. Four. So the first thing, and I use this over the summer, but this smells so, so good. This is Avo Bath, and you can see the colors are amazing. It makes a great green color in your bathtub, and it smells, it smells like avocados. It smells very sweet, kind of candy-like, but at the same time, you get that note. I would say you could smell a little bit of avocado, but I think it smells really good, though, and it's a very nice, it's a summer bath bomb, of course, but, or spring but I have to use it, you guys, because I really like it, so there you go. Um, it's real, and they, they tried to imprint the name on top, but it didn't really work. But this is usually around, again, I'd say like $8.95-ish. You have to check the prices yourself. I don't have the exact ones. Most of them I know, but this one I'm not 100% sure. But it's an amazing bath bomb, you guys. So, so good. All right, so the next one, I'm gonna put it back in the gift box. So the next one, uh, this is, let me just, uh, refer to what it is called. All right, you guys. And I will actually tell you that the Avo Bath Bath Bomb has a fresh avocado and olive oil scent, and it smells very citrusy, and I think it's amazing. Now, this is rocket science, you guys. Look how cute this bath bomb is. You don't even want to put it in your bath. There we go. Um, it, it's smooth, soaring to beautiful, multicolored bath water, and it, uh, uh, I can't even speak today. Otherworldly lemon bergamot 
perfume. So like they said, the lemon bergamot perfume, I can definitely smell the lemon. I can't really smell the... I really can't smell what they're saying is also in it, but really, that is amazing, you guys. Um, they don't include the price, sadly. But I will tell you, this whole gift box, if you want to give this amazing, amazing gift box, it is $28.95. It is the perfect gift. Um, I really like, I mean, obviously I haven't put these in yet, but I really like, um, I've used all of these products before, but I wanted them in a gift box, so. I told somebody that they should get it for me for Christmas, and they did in this gift box, which is amazing, you guys. So the next thing, this is, let me just look at what it's called, you guys. I forget sometimes the names. Oh, this is easy. This is Yellow Submarine. That's obvious. <laughs> but, oh my God, they're, they're all so adorable. Okay, so this is Yellow Submarine. They say that this one smells like tropical scented waters, and it's gonna uh, basically, oh, it does. It smells like coconut, you guys. Mmm. Oh, I really like that one. This is a good one right here. Smells a lot like coconut. You can smell that kind of tropical water idea that they're after, and it, it's really cute. So, like, why not? And by the way, their, their um, gift rack is little, like, stars, which I think is adorable, um, you guys. Okay, and the last thing in here, they stopped selling this, or at least they're not selling it right now. They might bring it back. But this is... When fidget spinners were popular, because um, they, they're not as popular anymore, but this is a fidget spinner bath bomb. They literally call it a bubble spinner. And this is another uh, bubble bar, which is truly amazing. So these three, you guys, these three in here, those were all bath bombs. But this one can be used more than once. Of course, you guys can break apart the bath bombs. It's just a lot of effort. So again, you guys can see, and you run this under the water, and I think this is the coolest thing, because when you run it under the water, it actually spins it. And it has an amazing scent. They say it smells like citrusy, and yeah, let's smell it. I definitely smell the citrus in this. That is amazing. Oh, that smells really good. Okay, so that is the last one in the gift box. So you have four things for about $30. It's $28.95, um, but about four things for about $30, which I think is amazing, you guys. But, you know, again, like I said, in the, in, um, like I said, all of these things, I have other stuff off camera, but all of these things are amazingly scented and they smell great. It's just that they can be a little bit expensive, but I totally think that if you have the money and you want to have a luxurious, amazing bath experience, this is the perfect place to go to pick up those amazing um, experiences. And they have so much stuff. They have shower gels, they have bath bombs, bubble bars, bath melts, all this amazing, amazing stuff. And I'm actually going to be doing a spring haul from um, Lush, which I'm really excited about. I can't wait for them to put out their spring stuff because um, they have amazing bubble bars for that. But you guys, this is an amazing gift box. You should totally get it, amazing green color. And I don't have the packaging, obviously, that it came in, but it comes with a cute little rubber ducky kind of um, packaging. Perfect birthday gift for any time, time of year gift. Like I said, I got this for Christmas, and I'm still happy, so I don't care that it was for birthdays. It's amazing. So I don't have this on camera, but I'm gonna try to insert a picture like right here. Um, but if you don't see a picture, I apologize. But um, the world's smallest disco, this was about $7.95. Now, I thought, wow, it smells good. It looks good. But let me tell you guys, the smell, I can't even describe it. It did not smell good. Guys, if you tried the world's smallest disco, please let me know if you liked it. And if it left you a ring in your bathtub, because it left my bathtub stained, you guys. I love Lush, I love all of their products, but this one, I definitely say avoid because there's so many better options and this one totally made my bathtub just completely stained. So I'm trying to get it out right now, um, but it was just, that was not good. Now another one I got was the Santa Bomb Bomb. Now the Santa Bomb Bomb is two bath bombs for $9.95 and I think that's worth it and it smelled amazing. It had a definite spicy smell to it and definitely a little bit sweet at the same time. We'd like to do that at Lush. Um, smelled really good, uh, amazing color, and didn't leave any rings. Um, the other one I got was the, the final one, or I think it's the final one. I got Shoot for the Stars Bath Bomb. Now the Shoot for the Stars, yeah, that's awesome. The Shoot for the Stars Bath Bomb is, is incredible, you guys. Um, it smells so, so heavenly. 
It has a very nice, I would almost say caramel smell, caramel smell. Uh, it's very nice, it smells very sweet and candy-like, and it's amazing, creates a blue, beautiful blue color. And finally, um, I, and I forgot this one as I was saying that, um, I use the Pearl to sell bath bomb. Now, it does not smell good upon smelling it, but when you put it in the water, it makes the most beautiful blue color, and then it starts to smell pretty good. Um, but again, it wasn't my favorite. I wouldn't probably get it again. But that is it, guys, for my Lush uh, haul. I hope you guys go ahead down below and hit that red subscribe button and hit that like button. And totally, I'll be posting videos again every Friday. There'll be a Disney vlog next week. So thank you guys for watching today's video. And that was my Lush haul. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Have a wonderful day.